Today it's based on politics or those in positions of differential advantage or religion or the military, but it's not really based on the end goal, goal being the well-being of people. The main aim is profit, wealth, property, and power. Roxanne Meadows isn't intimidated by establishment politics or big corporations. Powerful entities are abusing the monetary system, and they're afraid you'll realize the truth. People today really are, are distanced from how things work. They don't know what happens when they turn on the light bulb. They don't know what happens when they turn the faucet on. A lot of people in some ways are bystanders and they, we just supply jobs for them to keep them busy. You know, we make things to wear out and break down. In this system, you have to continuously sell things to keep it going. The greed of the world has victimized its people, but the most evident losers are planet. Promoters of a resource-based economy, the Venus Project recognizes what's at stake and their naturalistic surroundings serve as a constant reminder. We change the styles every year. We change the cars every year. We change the colors you can wear this month or next month, you know, and we become suckers to commercialism. And we don't, we don't blink an eye when we're just called consumers. Everyone needs the same thing. Clean air, clean water, arable land, from birth to death. and the ability to strive toward their highest potential. Maybe it's time we stop buying and instead start giving. In a time where people stand against each other, we need to find a way to stand with each other. The Venus Project is standing for change. What's the best way forward for the rest of us?